hi friends this is material this tutorial I will make uh, text box why why while using text box to search a data grid view one of my friend asking some doubts that's why I'm creating the videos for that uh, Chandino Novita uh, do you know coding for such grid view with combo box by text combo box by text and coding button refresh grid view okay Chandino Vidanti I will create the video for the for you Okay, first what can I do? I have a one project. Uh, it's a form one. I have the form. So first what can I do? I need to add some um, combo box. Combo box here. So uh, combo box where combo box combo box here. So I have a combo box. Okay. So I need to increase the font size because while you seeing the font size, it will, will be bigger to see. Okay. Uh, meanwhile, uh, just I'm increasing 10 font size and OK. Now I need to add one data grid view. Data grid view here. Okay. So I no need to. I need a search option only, right? So just I'm removing the editing, editing and adding. Okay. Now what can I do? Just double click the combo box. Here I need to write the code for you for that. So meanwhile I am adding the database. Uh, connecting the database I have already one database called uh, SQL Server 2008. Uh, my database name is uh, Marketing World. Marketing World database. I have the Marketing World database. I will show you. Go to click here database here Marketing World. So I need to connect the the, the database in SQL Server Explorer in Visual Studio. So first I click here connect to database. Here I put dot or else you have to put local host or else you have to put your computer name. Okay. I would just dot and select my database is marketing world world once uh, marketing world uh, once you have the express edition once you have this is the original edition you have express edition database then you need to put like that slash uh, SQL X like that so my mine is not a express edition so I'm just removing those details and select and ok so I will open the database here connect the database and extract the database I need to uh, configure the database uh, uh, grid view I have one table is customer application table here many many of the field is there I need to configure some field so first what can I do right click open uh, new query here because meanwhile you writing a code in a select query that time you made a mistake uh, sometimes you made a mistake that's why I just customer code customer name and gender and uh, date of birth age and father name one one two three four five six so this is enough for me so uh, just and copy those details control C copy the code now here uh, I, uh, I need to using system dot uh, data dot SQL client I importing those namespace here and now I'm writing SQL connection C O N equal to new connection. Now just go to your, click your database and right click the properties. You will get the connection string here. Then control A, control A, select all these, control C. Here just you have to paste it. And control V. Okay. Now I have done it. Okay, uh, now I need to SQL data adapter SDA equal to new 
SQL data adapter. Okay, here I am writing the code. Sorry, I already uh, I forgot to copy the code, right? So I am going to once again copy customer application and close. I need customer code, customer name and gender, age and other name is enough for me. Control A, Control C and close the code and paste here. Make it one line, single line, sorry, single line. Meanwhile, I am changing the code size to a little big bigger, then you will see clearly. Select customer code and customer name from here showing the error because we didn't call the connection here. Here I have the connection, this connection. So I write the connection here. So I am minimize this so you will see a little bit quicker. Okay. And now I need to declare data table. Data table dt equal to new data table here uh, sda dot fill dt. So data grid view one dot data source equal to dt control s so i need to configure this combo box here so i am writing the where condition here where i need to I need to select so I need to change like I need to put one text box also I right now I understand the actual coding here where is text box okay change a font size to a little bit bigger then okay now adding plus code customer customer name and click double click here here I am cut the code here control X control X and paste it here I am writing if if combo box one dot text equal to sorry double equal to because we go and edit edit code this is just and copy because we make any spelling mistake now it will show error so control V so control X adjust and paste it box one dot text equal to customer name
then again I am copying the code and paste it here what can I do just I put the where condition already so here I am seeing the customer apps right this is customer code so properties control C control V like text box one dot text here I put one percentage here you have to see this is double quote this is single quote inside that here I am changing like that so I am copying this this statement once again control C control V so this is what I have to clearly see this is only one where condition where statement is there here first is here I need to change customer name properties control C and control V so <coughs> in combo box I am selected the customer code then it will work uh, search by using the customer code and in combo box I am choosing the customer name it will uh, searching like uh, customer name so we will run run the pro pro program so first I am selecting customer code and here I am typing u one one zero 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 two two one so here to see like that so I'm searching like we will get those details here okay same while I'm just changing the customer name now I'm selecting R A J A M M L M M A L like that we can search many details it automatically refresh also dot shiva so so we can search like that okay guys we will meet on next tutorial